The Salvation Army was founded in 1865 by a Methodist minister named William Booth who saw people on the street having a really hard time and they were lost. They needed someone to help them and that's how the Salvation Army began with William Booth. The Salvation Army in Port Chester has grown. We're doing a lot of very beautiful and, and crazy things for youth and, and for adults as well. We run a music and creative program for children between the ages of 6 and 18. We have our women's ministries and during the week we have open basketball. Uh, our gym is open for the community and we have a lot of children but also teenagers and adults who come in and use our facilities for basketball. Port Chester Salvation Army here is available for you. It's a safe place. So try the, the soft, the uh, soft buzzes. I learned how to play drums, percussion, Salvation Army. Um, I went to the Star Search competition, so I'm from New York. I won first place in level two, snare drumming. We had a family, wife, husband, two children. Um, he lost his job and she was not working because she had cancer, among other things. This family had nothing to eat on their table, uh, sporadic work for the husband, and they were going through a really rough situation. Then she began coming to our women's ministries, and little by little, her children started integrating themselves as well through our music and creative arts programs, and I just remember this one time that we found out that they didn't have any coats, um, any of them. Our women's ministries decided that we were going to buy them coats for, it was a very cold winter. And when I walked in, knocked on her apartment door, and she opened the door, um, she was just really touched that the women had thought of her and her family, and we were able to get these coats for them, along with you know, a couple of food bags, and it, they were just so thankful. Um, it was beautiful, um, and that's, that's what God called us for. That's what God called us to do. That, to me, was one of the most amazing things about being a minister in the Salvation Army. Jesus walked the streets, and he saw a lot of need for those who were in pain, for those who were suffering. And the Salvation Army does the same thing because we love Christ. It is because he saved us. It is because he's touched our hearts. That is why we open our doors every day. The Salvation Army is built on volunteers and supporters. And it's because of people like you that we can do what we do. The Salvation Army is alive in Port Chester and we're growing, and uh, we would really like for you to be part of it. Not only in Port Chester, but across New York, across the country, and across the world. <laughs>